Hello, HitFilm Sensei here, and today we're going to talk about how to create a clean plate, which is oftentimes necessary to do certain types of effects. So I've already opened up HitFilm 4 Express. You can download this free piece of software at hitfilm.com. Would highly recommend it. I'm going to import some footage to work with. Earlier on my cell phone, I created some raw footage of me throwing some punches and kicks at my dojo and we're going to use that to create a disappearing effect using a clean plate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag this down to the editor timeline. Here's a little tip. If you don't need the audio or you don't need the video from a specific piece of footage, what you do is when you drag and drop it, you hold down the Alt key and then it only drags down either the video or the audio. So since I'm not going to need the audio, I'm just going to drop the video portion of this. And then as I scrub through the timeline, you can see that I'm going to walk out here after setting up the camera and then I'm going to start punching and kicking. What I'm going to do is just trim this up a bit like this. And then I'm going to right click and ripple delete that gap. And then after I'm done punching and kicking for a while here, then what I'm going to do, I'm scrubbing through the timeline to find that, is I'm just going to stand up like this. And then after I stand up, I'm just going to walk out. Well, right now, now that there's nothing here, this is what we call the clean plate. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to create the clean plate by clicking on the options up here in the upper right hand corner, export frame, and I'm going to export this. I'm going to call this clean plate. Click OK. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to import that clean plate that I have created. All right, so what I want to do now is I want to create a composite shot. So I right click on that, click uh, create a composite shot and click OK. And now it's a composite shot with all the same characteristics that I had before. As I get to the point where I stand up, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull this back a little bit so that I disappear. Uh, but so did everything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my clean plate and drop it down underneath. And now look, as that comes along, then all of a sudden, poof, I disappear. Right? This is a basic, simple version of this, right? But the point is, is that this is how you would create that. And really, that looks pretty good. It doesn't look too far different. A lot of times, your clean plate might have a little bit of a lighting issue. Uh, or something like that that you might have to grade. But most of the time, this is how it works. Now, if I wanted to say fade out here, for example, uh, what I might do is open this up, go to the transform properties, keyframe the opacity, and maybe knock that down to zero, and then back up, say, one second to 1216, and then go back up to 100%. And then when you play that footage, all of a sudden it is disappearing like that. So. However you want to create that disappearing effect, you could use some different different ways of doing that. But that's basics of how to create a clean plate. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and I'll be happy to answer them. Otherwise, thanks for watching.